Potentially hazardous Apollo asteroid is sweeping towards our Earth, expected to have a flyby to our planet in May. The Apollo asteroids, as we know, are the ones that intersect Earth's uh, trajectory, Earth's path, Earth, Earth's orbit. The Apollo category space rocks believed to be the most dangerous intruders because they intersect our planet's orbits with theirs and prompting NASA's tracking system to closely monitor their movements, of course. An almost 1,500-foot asteroid is now hurtling towards our planet. It will come particularly close May 7. This is besides the asteroid that's coming at us on April 29 in just three days. This is another one coming at us about a week after that, May 7. NASA's Center for Near-Earth Object Studies revealed on its website, the space rock is dubbed 2009XO or 438908, and according to the agency's estimates, judging by the way it reflects light, could eventually turn out to be more than 210 meters in diameter or more than 600 feet across. The 2009XO is designated as a potentially hazardous object by NASA because it belongs to the Apollo class of asteroids, meaning that their orbit crosses the paths with the orbit of our planet. The asteroid will be moving at 12.2 kilometers per second, that's about 33,000 miles per hour. When the clock strikes midnight on May 7, it's not expected to come closer than 3,393,570 kilometers to our planet on that day, but it's still considered close and potentially dangerous by NASA. The rocks orbit the sun every 926 days, but only approaches it from a distance of 127.5 million kilometers. The Apollo asteroids usually spend most of their lifespan outside of the orbit of our planet, contrary to the Aten asteroids, and some of them are carefully monitored by NASA because of their potentially hazardous status and also because of the significant regional damage they can cause in the event of a collision, obviously. Of course, we still have no way of protecting Earth from any type of collision from a, a big-sized asteroid. This is on Sputnik News. If you'd like to join me on my Patreon account, you will hear content not covered by mainstream media. These riveting stories will be based on my research and I will state my opinions and give my personal insight on diverse and controversial subjects and world events, events not covered by mainstream media and not certainly on not supported by YouTube guidelines. So whatever I have on my Patreon most of those will not be on my YouTube channel. Please consider becoming a member today. More of the, the most significant and important videos will be on my Patreon channel. Your support helps me to continue my research and keeps this YouTube channel alive. And we depend on your support, your generous charity, because we help economically challenged families here in Athens, Greece in Capota, and we also help the young generation with university tuition and the community around our church. Thank you.